CPITN index is used to assess. The options were degree of periodontal destruction, amount of calculus percent, treatment needs, degree of inflammation of gingival tissue. CPITN, one of the famous index, okay, it is given by WHO and FDA joint committee. Okay, so why it is so important, you know, because in WHO has recognized this index as a one of the standard index to be included in all kind of oral health survey indexes. So now going into the details of CPITN. CPITN full form itself, you know, it's basically we talks about treatment needs. Okay, community periodontal index of treatment needs. So in this index, we will come to know about it, how it is affected and how what are the treatments it's needed. Okay, going into the detail, CPITN index requires CPITN Pro. This is one special probe used for this purpose. CPITN probe is of two types. One is clinical one, another one is epidemiological one. Okay. Clinical, we know this is a specific and specialty oriented kind of. Epidemiology is like a general survey for a whole group and populations, right? So if you look at this probe, probe this is specially designed, you know the specialties of probe, the whole probe will weigh around 5 grams only. Okay. The even including the handle and the tip, everything includes 5 grams only. Okay. So if you look at the tip, the tip is designed like this with the this pollen is having 0.5 mm radius, okay, diameter. 0.5 mm diameter. Diameter is very very important because it is they asked in one question like what is the tip of the CPITN and the options were like 0.5 mm radius, 0.5 mm diameter and like that. So it is 0.5 mm diameter in thickness. The other markings include 3.5, 5.5, 8.5 and 11.5. The basic difference between CPITN E and clinical is the 8.5 and 11.5 no these markings won't be there okay the whole length of the tip is 11.5 okay till this one in this 8.5 and 11.5 won't come in epidemiological study only it include these three values only it included in epidemiological whereas in clinical all the five values will come so now looking into this one, this sequence also very very important. There are so many questions used to come from this one. What are the markings like 3.5 to 5.5? There is a red black color band like a hole spread. It, will, it is spreaded in the whole area. It is in black in color. Whereas in 8.5 and 11.5, black color marking only there. No band is there. Okay. So it is very important. Band is presented in between 3.5 to 5.5 whereas marking is present in 8.5 and 11.5. This is also one of the famous MCQ. So I think it is clear now. Probe, there is a two types E and E, E and C, and what are the difference and what are the size and calibrations. Now going into the uh, index now. See if you insert a probe, this CPITN probe, if you it is not going okay, like having normal sulcus depth, it is called zero with no bleeding. With bleeding on probing is present, then it is included as 2. If you look at the 2, bleeding on probing is there and supra and or subgingival calculus is usually to present. 0, there is no bleeding on probing, 1, bleeding on probing is there but no calculus and is present. 2, the same depth is there but instead the calculus and log is present with additional bleeding on probing is there. Coming to the 3, 3 is the tricky part coming here. For example, this is we know that probing depth. If the probing depth is above, if the red mark is in bit <coughs> inside the sulcus, then it is considered as score 3. Okay, understand it? When inserting into the pro, uh, sulcus, the red mark is half of this inside and half is present outside, right? So, in such case, we have to give the scoring 3. If the whole red mark is in, into the sulcus, then we have to give score 4. 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4. 0 means no bleeding and probing with sulcus depth is almost normal only. Okay. 1 means bleeding and probing, 2 means calculus and universe percent, 3 means half visible, red band will be half visible and half is insert, inside the sulcus. 4th is completely invisible, the red band is. Okay. Now coming to the interpretation in the parental status and CPA 10 score. 
this is the one enlarge it here see if you look at the periodontal status if it is healthy the scoring criteria what i have to zero means it is healthy bleeding and probing means score it is one calculus means two packets four or five means half visible okay then it is three greater than six it is four so these kind of periodontal status and score it's it is CPIT and interpretations. Now, each interpretation have one separate and respective treatment codes. Okay, we will see that also in detail. For example, treatment code 0 means no periodontal treatment. Okay, it means tissues are normal, so only no treatment. Oral hygiene improvement, that means bleeding and probing. Calculus removal, this is also bleeding and probing with calculus are present. So, they have included calculus removal. Okay, and coming to this, uh, th this if you look at this one, 2 will be repeating twice. This is also calculus removal and oral hygiene improvement for the red band if it is half visible. Okay. Coming to the three, that is complex periodontal care like root scaling, root planning, and all it will be included in this complex periodontal care, like surgical periodontal surgery, will also come in treatment code three. Now going into this one, CP18 score we have seen the first table and treatment need we have seen this one. This all the matching this one. If it is normal. Okay, we treatment health in hygiene instruction means scaling with hygiene instruction. Three means again two scaling with hygiene instructions. Four means complex periodontal will come. So these are the basic CP18 score and TN and treatment need course. So basically CP18 means community periodontal index for treatment need. Now coming back to the question. In the question, the simple thing they have asked like what for what they have used to assess the CP18 index. Degree of periodontal destruction, no. Amount of calculus, no. De treatment needs, yes. Degree of inflammation in gingival tissue, no. So here the answer is CPITN index. For a simple one, by if you know the full form itself, we can answer the thing, but we have explained in detail for easy to solve any questions if it come in CPITN index. Here the answer is treatment need only.